uh, rear wheel WSS on a Harley. Uh, I'll tell you about it inside. Revelator L. Hello, welcome to Revelator Alpha. I hope you enjoy the channel and the series. Please like, share, subscribe, leave loads of comments below. Check out the website revelatoralf.com. So, in this video, I'm talking about the Softail series on the uh, Harley Davidson, uh, but also on the Sport Glide, which I'm riding now. So, what is the rear WSS? Well, it's the rear wheel speed sensor, and what that does, that actually feeds into the ABS uh, system on the bike, the anti-lock braking system. Now, just as on the front one, uh, so if you watch my video for that, uh, on the rear axle you have a collar that goes around it. It's almost like a spacer, but it's actually collar. So it doubles up as a spacer as well. And it's right here. And on the underside you've got this ABS cable coming out right there. So I'll just show you. It's this cable right here. That one there. Now, that cable goes into the ABS module, then it works in conjunction with the ECM and uh, the BCM as well to uh, make sure that uh, your bike, uh, when you're riding along, uh, the front wheel, rear wheel are not going to lock up uh, unnecessarily. Uh, and now if you're really slow speed, for example, and you're on gravel, let's say right there on the side of the road there, uh, yeah, that's your bike, your front tire or rear tire, whatever, still may lock up. That's not what ABS does. It's actually under braking at slower speeds. Uh, that's where it's really going to work and also at higher speeds when you suddenly if you grab a sudden amount of brakes it will actually grip the uh, the, di the disc front disc or the rear disc and it actually will uh, add pressure then release pressure add pressure release pressure as it detects a change in the speed of the tire that is not the same as the other tire as well so basically both tires have got to be running at exactly the same uh, speed in order for that ABS to be working properly. As soon as it doesn't, uh, they're not running at the same speed, it detects an issue, therefore it, it kicks into life as it were and, uh, and releases pressure on the braking so that the tyre doesn't uh, lock up. How does it work? Well basically that collar around the, um, the, the rear axle uh, of the, the rear wheel. It's actually measuring a change in magnetic field and induction measured in Henry's, would you believe, uh, of the, and actually it's measuring a lot of the time the um, the rear pulley, the bolts on the rear pulley, that actually affects uh, a change in that ma magnetic field, changes the inductance, and therefore that can send a pulse out and it reads out onto the uh, ABS module. So that's it. That's what the uh, rear WSS is, the rear wheel speed sensor. It's all to do with the ABS, just like the front WSS. They work in conjunction with each other, working with the ABS module and with the ECM, BCM on the bike, all the electronics, sort out the bike, sort out your braking, and hopefully keep you safe on the road, which is always good. Uh, but uh, you know, always bear this in mind, whenever you think about ABS, don't ever try and uh, push it to its limit uh, so that you're really going to test this ABS, especially on loose gravel. You need to just, just brake normally, but it will assist you just in case you actually accidentally brake a little bit harder and then the tyres start to slip on the, on the surface or whatever it is. Anyway, I hope you found this useful. Please like, share, subscribe. Leave loads of comments below. Let me know what you think. Uh, check out the website revelatoralf.com and uh, check out the Harley Parley page on there as well for extra information. Right, catch you on the next video. Ta-da now. Revelator L.